everyone. I'm Sherry from Sherry's Kitchen, from my kitchen to yours. This morning we are going to talk about, we're going to go back to our day three, but we missed one day. It was a busy day yesterday, so what I did was pushed it to today. We're on day four of our sprouting. sprouts I think because the weather is warmer they are sprouting so much faster these are ready for harvest almost but I'll give them one more day because I like every little inch filled up but they're ready for harvest so these are my alfalfa sprouts now for my fenugreek sprouts this is how far they've come now remember I put a quarter cup in each jar and soak them okay so these will have another couple days okay but I want you to show you the rack that I use because after you fill them up with water and drain them in the uh, sink, then you store them in the rack on an angle. And this is my little wooden rack I had gotten from Amazon, um, but they seem to be hard to find anymore. I can't find them. But they have other imitators like this, but this is the angle that they should be on. It drains a lot better when it's on an angle versus straight up like that, okay? So that's how our sprouts are doing, alfalfa and fenugreek. All right, now I'm gonna direct your attention to my um, microgreens. Remember, we're doing the black oil sunflower seeds. Now, remember last time we left off, I told you how I package it up. I put the weights up. I put the weights to encourage the roots to go down and the leaf part to come up. So I'm removing that now. Now, yesterday when I looked at them, they needed water. Why? Because look what happened. This is the lid that I had on here turned upside down. <clears throat> so this was on it upside down with the weights on it, okay? And so when I lifted it up, well really, this had lifted up off of the planter, as you can see, and it actually pushed up these weights. That's how strong they are. And when I lifted it up, I noticed that the roots have already started to grow down. So I had to put water in it yesterday. So you can see how the roots are and the leaves are coming up to the top. So I'm gonna say another four or five days, these should be ready to harvest. But we're gonna keep watching them. And as you can see, most of them have sprouted and you still have the black hulls on them. And some of them will, most of them will fall off as they are growing, okay? So here we are, day four. These are our black oil sunflower microgreens, and they are so delicious. This is one of my family's favorites. So give it a try, and I know you will enjoy them because they're really large and they're crunchy, and they have that flavor like a sunflower seed, okay? So uh, I hope you like it, and I remember to go to my page, like it, and subscribe. And... Uh, we're going to continue, so I'll see you in another four or five days and let you see the end result. Bye-bye.